Hello, I'm Ashley Gonzaga with ESPN Honolulu, and we are here in the gym for UH Women's Basketball Media Day. We're gonna to talk to some of the players and we're gonna have some fun. Seeing the coaches preseason poll and you guys getting ranked first, what are your thoughts about that? You know, my initial reaction was that big lump in the throat. It took me back to last year cutting down nets with this special, special group of girls. Um, it's hard work paid off, I guess, um, but it doesn't mean much in October. We want to be number one when it comes down to it in March. So uh, just a range of emotions hit me when I saw that. And you guys were number one in the Big West last year. So what are some things that you're looking forward to to try and get that repeat again this year? You know, this team, is, we've got to come together. Uh, you know, this team has to become their own identity, if that makes sense. Last year was all about Amy Atwell, and rightfully so. This year we need to find our own identity. And so I think this group will. They, they like each other. They're great in the locker room with each other. We have to continue to grow on the court, get that chemistry, find the right lineups. Um, but I think in order to be that number one team, you know, the stars have to align a little bit, you know, also. In the preseason coaches poll, you guys ranked number one. What are your thoughts about that? Um, well, you know, it's definitely good to see that other coaches recognize. <laughs> I'm just playing, but it definitely, like, um, it makes us feel good, you know, that obviously we put in all that work last year, and we're definitely here putting in work again to repeat it, so we'll see how this season goes. Just improving my stats overall, like, not turning over the ball, rebounding, assisting, points. Yeah. What about you, Joby? Individually, I think, um... Picking up my pace when transitioning into high school to college ball and um, um, showing what I got, I guess, as a freshman. Definitely shooting and um, just perfecting my craft down in the post is really what I'm working on. Definitely just to slow my game down. I'm pretty go, go, go. I just need to keep things simple and like pick my opportunities, if that makes sense, yeah. Definitely for me, it's my last go around. It's my sixth year of college sports. I'm really excited to go out here and play my best with the team. You know, my individual goals are definitely to be in the role that my coaches and my teammates need me to be in. And at this point, that's giving energy consistently and being a leader on and off the court. So in terms of individual goals and accolades, that doesn't necessarily matter to me as long as we are able to win that conference championship. Yeah, definitely um, to grow my game personally, I've been definitely trying to um, get better from shooting from the outside because I'm definitely more of an inside player, but you know, if I extend my game, then it's gonna be harder for teams to play me, so yeah. And I feel like every one of us have definitely been trying to like extend our game in that way. What are you most excited for this season? Um, I'm excited to just get going with our new group of girls and just show everybody what we've been practicing for. Yeah, so when you have a lot of incoming freshmen, new girls, um, what's it been like showing them around Hawaii, the island? Um, it's been good, but we have other local girls like Lily and Jovi, so they kind of help took on with that role just to show what a Wahoo looks like. And they're not shy at all, so they had a pretty easy time coming in. Awesome. Thank you. And I hear you are new to the island. You just moved here from Seattle. Yes. How has that adjustment been? It's been great. Weather-wise, obviously great. And people-wise, I couldn't have been welcomed better. I want to know, what is your go-to pre-game song? What are you listening to in the locker room, on the bus ride? Um, there's a lot. Um, I'm a big music fan, so I listen to whatever, whenever. There's a song that I, that I introduced the team to last year. It's a Samoan song. It's by a Samoan artist. It's called Chihu Wild Out by Savage, if you guys know what it is. My ultimate go-to pre-game song is Love Yours by J. Cole. Like that, straight up, she knew. Yep. Right answer. You know, like High School Musical and like, like Disney Channel, I've been like more like leaning towards, you know, Lemonade Mouth. Yeah. That's what I've been doing. Yeah, more Disney Channel songs. I love it. I love it. I'm a Disney fan myself, so <laughs> yeah, I respect yeah. that. I think it might be a little different in the fact that it's really not like pump up songs. I usually listen to more chill music to kind of like calm the nerves, get me grounded in my body. But I am a big fan of musical theater, and I listen to the song Defying Gravity from Wicked. I've listened to it since high school. I have always thought it made me jump higher and get pumped up for the game. Wow, see, look at that. Great song, by the way. Great choice. We're going to do something fun now. We're going to test a little bit of sister instincts over here between Lily and Jovi. So on the count of three, we're going to see if you guys can think of the same word. Okay. All right? You guys ready? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Channel it, channel it. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Basketball. Basketball. Ah! <laughs> oh my God. 
<laughs> she did this. She's like. Who are some players to look out for this year? You know, I think that everyone's excited to, to see the Hawaii girls, right? Kelsey and I and the, and the two sisters, Joby and Lily, and, you know, our walk on Hallie. I think that those are going to be the fan favorites, uh, rightfully so. You know, they live here. People have grown. They've grown up watching them play. So I think that's going to be a really fun combination. I think the other one's Deja Phillips. You know, she's put the work in. She, you know, has been awarded some great honors in her career here. She's worked really hard in the offseason. Um, I feel like she is a first-team all-conference player, in my opinion. So I think she's going to be another player for people to really watch. Awesome. Thank you very much. Thanks, Coach. Appreciate it.